You got that to go big time. Oh yeah, I'm trying to. I started. I have to. I'm trying to be like you. <laughs> with me, you know, Amen. <laughs> uh, Tyler Devereaux, um, was that a if, question? No, 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 that's who you are, you know, so if you don't know, Tyler's a management partner of MF uh, Capital, um, he's a very successful multi-millionaire real estate investor, um, but I'm going to let you kind of tell a little bit more about yourself. Oh, buy a bunch of apartments, man. <laughs> buy a bunch of apartments with investors. Have for a long time. We love it. So, yeah. So, yeah. And right. then we have our education company where we teach people to buy apartments with investors. Yeah. So, if you had to kind of describe to somebody how your journey, how did you get here? Uh, dude, I became... It's a loaded question, right? Because, like, I believe there's these things that lead you to where you go, you know, and there's things in my childhood that happened that made me very curious about wealth, like I felt like it was my responsibility to change the narrative for my family, mm -hmm. and it was my responsibility, you know? that's yeah. what I, so I was always curious about wealth, always asking how people made money, always, 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 mm -hmm. um, and just always like well oriented like I needed to do more, think bigger, whatever, think bigger is a tagline for a reason, because I had to do more for everybody around me, you know? Mm -hmm. I felt that responsibility. I would never have it any other way, because that responsibility has just inspired me and forced me to do amazing things. Right. So I got into the single family space. Mm -hmm. uh, I had an internet business before that. Got into the single family space. But my definite major purpose has always been all circled around time. Yeah. The single family space did not provide that. Yeah. So when I learned about multifamily, I actually learned about it from my partner in this business, MF Capital Partners. Yeah. Uh, his name's Ryan Woolley. And, uh, he had just went to a class to learn, you know, back in the day. And yeah. then he, I ran into him at an airport. He told me he learned how to buy apartments. I blew my mind. I went yeah. to the same class and I go, been freaking all in, been all in since. That sounds great. But let's say for a young person that's maybe getting out of high school, doesn't really know too much, and is interested in this space, what would you kind of tell them? Like, how would they kind of jump into this pool, I guess? Yeah, so first I just know what's, what's possible. Mm -hmm. You don't, I promise you, and I know you know this, but mm -hmm. you don't know what's possible. Like, right. You think you want to be a doctor, a dentist, a lawyer, or whatever. No, you don't. <laughs> no, you don't. Right. I mean, I don't know. Maybe you do. But like, go explore and understand what's possible. Because mm -hmm. when I started to do that, and literally that's what I did. I was asking people all the time what you did, how you made money, what you did, how you made money, all the time. Because mm -hmm. I, I was curious about it. I didn't know anybody ever that did this. Yeah. I literally knew, no, knew nobody. But I would say a lot of people are afraid to fail. So they really jump in like what would you maybe tell them so that's was part of my advice but number one like before you even dive in you'll see what's possible right number two then focus on your personal growth yeah your personal growth like so what i mean by that is read like, my life started to change when i started to read and educate i didn't go to college i got a college degree i got a high school degree right, right? like these people you're telling me to give advice to right. i got that but then i started to education is important but I had education, self-education, started to study all the time, dude. all sorts of books that I was reading. I read, you know, 40 to 50 books a year, and I dive into them, and then I apply them. I would say the same thing, man. You focus on personal growth, you will obtain a lot of things. Okay. And then think bigger, dude. So how do you how do you learn how to do that? You come to classes like this and learn how to do this, you know? Yeah. So, yeah. Did you always have a vision for real estate? No, not, no, that is not at all. I, if you would have told me... If you would have told me freaking 10 years ago that I would own apartments, I'd be like, yeah. get the fuck out of here. No. Yeah. Like, not even on my realm of possibility. Yeah. Single family stuff, maybe. Yeah. It, wasn't, it wasn't my vision. I didn't, I didn't think that's what I would do for a, a yeah. profession. Yeah. Um, but I knew that I could buy a single family property because, I mean, I knew people that owned those. Yeah. But apartments, not even on my realm. Yeah, I would say today, you definitely changed like my mindset because I was kind of focused on single family, single family, single family. And like you kind of opened my mind. To kind this, of. Well, you definitely opened my mind to this world and I'm definitely going to explore it a lot more, you know? Love so it. I really appreciate that. Um, but for, let's say, like beginners like myself, what would be the first step? First step mm -hmm. of what? To becoming you. No way. Oh, gee, that, you ain't even do that. <laughs> no, I'm just, I'm just kidding, bro. Your first step is personal growth. Like, uh -huh. Always personal growth. But yeah, your first yeah. step to acquiring apartments. Uh -huh. 
It's a question that I get all the time. Like, what's the first? First step is a step. Like, take a step. This is the first step. Okay. Then you go and you call brokers. That's a step. You talk to investors. That's the first step is your decision. Right. Like, think about what you told me right before you asked that question. Remember? Yeah. What did um, you say? You're going to explore. You don't fucking explore. You exactly. do it or you don't. Exactly. You explore here, now you don't do it or you don't. Yeah. Because so if you explore and you're going to learn, you ain't going to make it. <laughs> That's yeah. fact. It's going to be a for If you're going to do it, you got to dive all in. So your first step is make a decision on what direction you're going. Whether it's anybody who's listening, whether that's you or anybody else that's here. Because once you make the decision, mm -hmm. once you make the decision, then you receive inspiration the whole way through. Like, it's yeah. definite as a purpose, right? I make this decision, and then I sold myself on that decision all the time. Yeah. This is why I did it. This is what it's going to get me to. And then I start recognizing the things that can get me to where it is. Yeah. So step one is define what it is you want. What yeah. do you want life to look like? What yeah. is it? Get clear with it. Yeah. Like your mind doesn't go to work on generalities. It goes to work on specificity. Right. And then dial in how to get there. So, okay, if this is what I want, does this vehicle help me get there? If it does, then you just freaking all in. Mm -hmm. And then, then you do it the learning process. Yeah. Focus on learning versus earning in the beginning. Like your first few deals are going to be your least profitable deals. You learn, dude. It's a process that will compound, compound, and then you'll you'll leapfrog my ass as far as what I'm doing. But it all starts with decision, man. It definitely takes action to get to where you want to be. Um, and let my last question: Who did you like look up to when you got into the space? Like, who was your mentor? Yeah, and, a lot of people. Dave Lindahl was the first class that I ever went to. Okay. I read his. I went to his class. Dave Lindahl. Then I read his book, Multifamily Millions. I read his book, Emerging Real Estate Markets. Okay. Gained a great relationship with Dave. Mm -hmm. I love Dave. Mm -hmm. Dave is a great person. Yeah. And I would never be where I'm at without Dave. So Dave Lindo, for sure. Awesome. I, I, I like that. And I appreciate you for having this uh, short Absolutely, bro. I appreciate it. I loved it. Hey, go do what you got to do to get what, done what you got to get done, whatever that is. <laughs> right. obviously, it should be apartments. Don't be done. No, it definitely is apartments. <laughs> But yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. I appreciate it. And if you enjoyed, uh, if you want to check out Tyler on Strip, you're all over it, everywhere. Hit Instagram. me up, dude. Social, yeah. IG, YouTube, that Tyler Devereaux. D-E-V-E-R-A-U-S. And also check out Multifamily Mindset also. Yeah. So thank you. I appreciate it. Peace.